What's up, everybody? You clicked on this video because you saw the title and you got a small stash and you want it to be bigger. <laughs> and you don't want to pay more money for EOD. Well, I got you. Most people don't realize you can actually upgrade your stash in the hideout. Cost different items, some stuff you can find running around interchange in the stores. You can find them in gym bags. Let me help you figure this out. It's very simple. I'll teach you how to upgrade your stash for free. So sit back and let's talk about it. Okay, so for the first item that I suggest getting as soon as you can to get more stash space is a Lucky Scav Junk Box. This will give you another 196 slots for all the items you need for quest, bartering, trading, for quest items that, that you will need late into the wipe for Kappa, and for holding the junk that you don't need as soon as you find it. You can actually get it from the therapist. Level 1 for only 1.1 million in my opinion this is something that while i'm doing the simple quests i push to grab this even with the od just to throw stuff in there so my stash is clean and it's not a mess <laughs> so let me show you where you need to go to actually upgrade your hideout a lot of people don't even know this go in your hideout right when you go into it left side you actually have a place that says stash this is where you upgrade so with the hideout you can actually go to the tarkov wiki and you can actually look under the hideout section with i'll put that link in the video description below you can click on any item in your hideout of course we're going to be focusing on your stash because everyone needs a bigger stash let's just be honest here this is one case where Of course, purchasing of standard edition, you're going to get a 10 by 28. No construction time. You get that right off the bat. The next edition, which will be level two, you can get that by buying left behind edition or by upgrading your stash. It only takes 24 hours. And what you'll need is WD-40, 100 mil, one hand drill, five packs of nails, 10 packs of screws, 2.5 million rubles this is a lot and level one vents that's a lot my favorite place of finding them is in ollie i love running through ollie at the beginning of wipes especially because there's a lot of players rushing places to grab stuff so i usually get left alone i can do runs through ollie always check toolboxes toolboxes have so many packs of nails and screws especially if you get the emercom spawn and you're running from emercom all the way up to the cash registers you can do a sweep through all the aisles and then just run back out the front and head straight towards railway for stash level three this is where it starts to get real expensive it's not cheap this is this is for the true grinders this is if you purchase eft prepare for escape this will give you the stash size of 10 by 48 otherwise you're going to need two electric drills 15 packs of screws seven packs of nails 8.5 billion rubles level three prep or level three ragman level two vents and level two heating it takes 48 hours to build this is a lot you're not probably gonna get here till you're at least level 25 30. ragman level three is a lot harder than prep or level three you can level prep or up pretty quick because it gives you a lot of easy tasks that are very front loaded in the game same thing with this one you're gonna want to look for toolboxes do scav runs do player runs i love interchange i know people won't like it another place you can do this is on reserve you're running around reserve there's tons of gym bags you run around the pawns or the knights and even bishops between you're good to go you can do just those runs you can avoid players just do your little runs through building this is still going to be very expensive all the stuff you get that you don't need for this you can just straight sell level four it's the eod level this this is basically because you're a super grinder you're one of those rats that just makes 200 billion rubles a, a, a wipe i think this is a level that almost nobody's gonna want to try to get to this is a level that if you get to it it's because the game's not doing wipes anymore and you didn't want to buy eod or like they said they're not going to offer eod anymore so you're going to need 200 000 euros 10 screw nuts 10 bolts five sustrillo ceiling foams two ratchet wrenches peacekeeper level four ragman level four which is a minimum a minimum of level 42 generator level three workbench level three heating level three and intelligence level three this 
is part of the reason why I personally got an EOD account before they actually fully launched this game. They're supposedly going to keep giving you free stuff after and not force you to buy any upgrades or any changes down the road if you bought EOD and they're not going to offer it after launch. So that's personally why I did it. This is a very huge group of things. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you made this far in the video. If you got any questions, come by the Twitch stream. I'm live every Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, 9 p.m. Eastern time. Sunday, I start around six. Stop by, ask me questions. If you need help, you got an idea for another video, drop on in, say hi. Otherwise, I'll check you in the next video. What's up, bro? <laughs> and you want it to be bigger. Brain just like fart. All right. Two.